Shannon's going to be a little <laughs> excited here. We have some breaking <laughs> news just in the Smithfield Little Leaguers have just won their first game in the World Series. I might have whooped in the studio, <laughs> almost interrupting Anita's live shot just now. We have team coverage. Matt Paddock is standing by with the support the boys are getting back here in Rhode Island. But first, Sam Knox is here with an update on how all things went in that game. Sam? Shannon, you would have thought that you were at the game. I mean, that was fantastic. The boys from Rhodey, they hang on to win. Connor Curtis, the story of this one, struck out 15 batters in five and a thirds innings. We'll pop up the full screen for you here. They are the winners tonight, three to one, the final. So, as I said, Connor Curtis was fantastic. Five and a thirds innings, 15 strikeouts. Smithfield is a winner over Henderson, Nevada. So, the boys from Rhodey continue. To win, they are on a roll. And while a bus load of family and fans traveled with the team to Williamsport, a lot more are watching from here at home. 12 News reporter Matt Paddock is live from a local watch party. And Matt, they're winners. What's the, what's the vibe? Sam, that sixth inning was an emotional roller coaster. Everyone inside of the bar here at the Trap in Smithfield were on their feet. The kids were going wild, and as you can see, these fans are still celebrating the big win, and all she could hear in that sixth inning is, let's go, Braden. Well, I just want you guys to enjoy this, everybody at home. These kids are absolutely fired up in Smithfield, and for great reason. The little leaguers from Rhode Island coming home with their first victory, three to one. So guys, you know, you can see all the fans here are extremely excited, 3-1, and I think all of the energy in here got sucked out of the room during that challenge, but as soon as they called him out for the first baseman who tagged it with his glove, for those of you that'll be watching those highlights later, the whole place erupting. But like I said, it was like pins and needles here in that sixth inning. Braden getting that first strikeout, then two batters getting on, and then getting two more outs. And I just want to send it back to the fans one final time. Can we get a let's go Smithfield? Let's go Smithfield! Yeah! Well, to everybody's ears at home, I apologize, but reporting live in Smithfield, Matt Paddock, 12 News.